kit list for the passage. Lithium battery starter, water, dry bag for the drone, PFD, wetsuit shoes, tools to get the lid off the ski, so 10mm spanner, T30 Torx, emergency knife, VHF, PLB, first aid kit, throw bag, flares, emergency paddle, that's the spare tow line, this is the main anchor line with buoy, a drogue or sea anchor, this is quite useful for getting the boat to sit in one orientation if you have to catch the drone out of the sky. Anchor chain, length of the ski, plus the Cooper Blue anchor, We've got the original go uh, grapnel anchor, sealskin socks, uh, nitrile gloves, novelty shark, don't need that. Uh, 17 litres of spare fuel, additional five cans of five litres of fuel. I've done my oil check, run for 30 seconds, leave standing 30 seconds, then take a reading. Level ground, all good. I've got the battery having a top up. Credit card, if I arrive somewhere random on a beach, I could anchor it up and then walk the fuel can. I have done 84 miles before on the fuel that's on the ski. Didn't use everything, but um, at least it means I can do 84 miles. And this passage one way is about 71, so I shouldn't have a problem. The iPhone is really useful for the safety TRX, so that can track me continuously if needed. Coast Guard have access to this so they can see exactly where I am and where I've been. So you can keep that running, you need a good cable. So this is a brand new cable, pins eventually corrode because of the salt in the air. Weather was predicted to be perfect for today, but although it's bloody gorgeous now, by the end of the day, where I'm heading, 60 miles out, it's about 10 miles an hour, which um, could make the jet ski slow. It's not a problem for the jet ski to get through, but it could mean I don't really make good time. 60 nautical miles to Ilfracoom, 60 nautical miles back. I'd have to refuel at Ilfracoom, so if I'm going to quit, I've got to quit before I've used half my fuel provision. So I'm going to go out, enjoy the day, it's five o'clock, see how far I get, come home. i got a great lunch stash. That can be my highlight, if nothing else. Time to get going. Third of the way, three temps of fuel gone, 36 nautical miles left, arrive 8 a.m. Hour left to go. It's pretty calm out here now. Here I am, same old thing. Singing deep, no ecstasy. Reality haunts Gotta be over halfway now. Uh, 27 miles left to go. We are Opposite Minehead. Minehead. Really, really calm. Time to freshen up a bit. Oh. Oh. Kind of a little bit clear. Cornwall, technically Devon. <sighs> Definitely worth it. If I saw another day, only to scream into. Sarah's got to refuel for me in Ilfracombe, so she's probably got a longer journey. Over there's Porlock, 12 nautical miles left. Time to eat. Mmm. Oh, yeah.
Ilfracombe. Finally. And the water's green.